Hello everyone, this is my project Rice Leaf Disease Detection. It's basically a deep neural network based application. I built this project for both Android and web application. Here I describe all the particular about my project like dataset creation, model train, implementation and final output. Here is the dataset description of my project. I use 2100 different images with 6 different class like bacterial leaf blight, brown spot, leaf scale leaf blast, narrow brown spot and healthy and you see that 350 images are contents in every class and I also give the data source from for my data set. I download different types of images from Kaggle then I finally selected this 2100 images for my final model. Here is the folder structure of my data set. Here you see that two types of images are present here train data and validation data. If I go to the train data then I see train images are present here. Similarly if I go to the validation data, I see validation images are present here. Okay. Now I analysis the model and accuracy. Here I use Inception V3 for my project, but I also try BZZ19, Resin 15, and other model. Generally, Inception V3 give me the best accuracy. That's why I keep it for my project, and I use 80% of my data for train the model and 20% for test the model. An accuracy I get from Inception B3 97% and Precision Recall F1 score are all similar to 97 or 98%. Now I go to the project folder where I build this project. So this is the project folder and you see that all the template and main folder are present here. So now I open it in, in my VS code and that's it and now I run this project if it successfully run then it will be run in foot 5000 so I need to wait for this okay it successfully run on foot 5000 and I open it in my browser It will opening and it may take little bit of time okay it's run and open successfully so user will see that this kinds of home page after open this project and also see this login form by using this login form and giving username and password they will able to log into the main project i am so now i am logging to the main page by giving my username and password so okay it's login successfully and user will see this project here is diff different kinds of functionality like predict window analysis phase search phase final result and so on go through and i will explore all this functionality one by one so first of all i predict an image for predicting for predicting an image user need to select any image from his source folder for example i predict a bacterial leaf blight image from my validation folder and I select it. After selecting, I click on predict image button and it may take little bit of time for predicting the image. Okay, it's running. Finally, it successfully predict the image and you see that class name is bacterial leaf blight accuracy 99% and id is this also get the probable remedy that's mean remedy suggestion associate with this class okay now i am search this result by this unique id this unique id is uh, for further inquiry about uh, this result for example i find this result by current unique id and that's it and here you see that all the information about this result user will able to see so now I predict another image from my validation folder I select a brown spot for example I select it and open and click on predict image button it may take little bit of time we need to wait for this
okay you see that it successfully run prediction also 97% accuracy and class is brown stool and also get the id and probable remedy suggestion okay so now i saw predict another image for example i predict healthy image and i select it you can select any kinds of image here and again click on predict image button and i need to and you see that it successfully predict and it's also healthy image and accuracy 96% and also get the unique id you see that no remedy suggestion is uh, need here because it's healthy image for example i another inquiry by this id here is the id and i search button and you see that class name healthy accuracy 96% and image are present here so now i predict another image for further clarification for example i select a leaf blast temple i select it i see the accuracy and it will running and you see that it's also correctly predict that's leaf blast accuracy 89% also get the unique id and suggestion remedy okay so this is the prediction window now i'm going to the analysis phase so in analysis phase it contains all the performance related information like accuracy precision f1 score and confusion matrix and also effect based accuracy and effect based loss everything present in here and in search phase it contains the chart and database related chart here that's it and the final result phase it's user can able to find the result by unique id okay that's it that's from my side thank you